you are coming to this insight free where where i'll give you an up close and candid review on how you can fix problem of gb whatsapp verification code problem or gb whatsapp unable to verify the otp and therefore not able to create or log in into your whatsapp account so i'm experiencing that problem and uh, i have experienced it for quite a while so i will show you how we can fix this problem once and for all even if you mistake you mistakenly put the wrong contact and login in into whatsapp don't get worried i will show you how you can get into the first step of agreeing to continue and logging in into gb whatsapp so in this case i'm using gb whatsapp but the same method applies to other whatsapp boards such as fm whatsapp tm whatsapp and also the normal messenger whatsapp which these what these whatsapps are built on so in order to fix this problem i'm experiencing this problem what you need to do is just come back into a phone home screen you need to click to whatsapp app in order to access the application details but if your phone cannot take you to this application detail interface using that shortcut don't get worried there are too many ways to figure out you need to come into your phone settings after getting to your phone settings you need to come to where we have apps and notifications after coming to where we have apps and notifications just click see all after clicking see all you can either search for gb whatsapp gb and uh, you can get into the this interface of application detail but if you cannot be able to search don't get worried we can get it manually so you just come to here we have gb whatsapp and get into the interface you need to come to where we have storage and coach clear the storage so this seems that it will delete all your metadata in gb whatsapp but don't get worried if you want to solve the problem so uh, in most cases just be ensuring that you have backup all the information in when using whatsapp since there is an option which whatsapp have introduced even to backup the head to head encrypted messages without the google cloud being able to mutilate the data which you save in the cloud it is a trade encrypted you can click ok then come back into your phone and try and log into whatsapp so you're just getting a fresh into the normal installation process rather than taking back to that process which was denying you access and start the new login so i will agree to continue so i will enter my contact then click next after clicking next so you shall wait for the verification to take process to take to take to continue processing so let's continue with the process so we shall wait for the verification code and wait if the whatsapp will be able to verify our contact so let's wait for whatsapp to verify so it is looking like whatsapp is too much being sophisticated in verification so the, verific the verification is complete so since so i can choose to contact media i can choose not now then i will so i'll be asked if i want to restore the back data which i had backup so basically i had backup my data in gb whatsapp i'll just click continue so i will allow the whatsapp to access my contact then from this point there is the backup so i will just click restore so i have around 172 megabytes to be resolved so right wait for approximately less than 60 seconds so that is one minute so let's wait okay. for the restore to take place so i will start with the normal login so you can enter the contact which you are, the name which you are, you are previously using in whatsapp so you just put my name then click next so the initializing process is taking place is taking place so after this initializing process commence 
to be able to log in into your WhatsApp account safely. So if you then clear the storage and the process is necessary, you can try to clear even the coach and the storage at the same time and try and see if the problem will be fixed. So we are good to go. And I'm now restored into my WhatsApp. So thank you for watching. Please don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and also a subscription so that we not miss out any of the future content like this. Also, you can put in the comment section if the video was helpful or not. So we value all the positive sentiment and negative sentiment. So thank you and bon appetit.